awesome view. It's a beautiful day. The sun is up over the horizon, so we can see now. There's very little wind, really no wind at all. So it'll be interesting to see, see once the uh, amount of work and effort and technology that is going into such a silly and stupid stunt is really staggering. It blows me away. But these Imagineers, guys, they're so impressive. I just want to thank all of them, Jim and Cal, Dan and John. They've actually yeah, started the inflating the uh, main no, the same way. And, uh, they, we need to wrap this really around. I think we're within the 15-minute range at this point, and uh, so uh, Matt Cord is going to stay up on the roof. I'm actually going to descend, and uh, we're at the Valley Forge Casino Resort. Hey, everybody, Matt Cord, and guess what? We're here for the launch of Vag. A gorgeous day on a Friday. I have my compass with me, so we can tell which direction is going. Right now, we're pointing northeast. There's Jim. I mean Tim. I mean Jim. I mean Tim. <laughs> All the other engineers. There's Vag, looking glorious. Turn her around. Turn her around. Without choking. Look at her face. Kind of like a Kardashian or something and a nice little tuxedo <laughs> vest and there's a little camera you can watch it at home and um, hopefully we'll have a successful launch today. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. There she goes, Virginia, sending high to the sky. Oh my, that looks She's awesome. Oh, that looks great. Crazy. That looks awesome. She is flying <laughs> Dude, I tell him now. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! She's already on her way down. We are parked literally, I don't know, 20 yards from her, right underneath. She's just hovering. She was stuck in one tree. The wind briefly took her out of that tree, but immediately put her in the tree due east. So she's stuck there right now. However, well, I, you know, I don't know if she's going to be able to come loose with this one. And, and it was funny, when she landed in that first tree, this lady who was the first one on the scene went over and hugged the tree. I don't know if that gets her anything, but uh, she, she uh, maybe she has a claim. I don't know. She's on the move! She's free! Fly, Virginia, fly! Well, you know what? I don't know. I mean, it, it's, um, I thought she was more... Uh, uh, attached to the last tree. So, so far, since the recap, she's been in three trees. Yeah. I'm at Can we throw a rock set or throw <laughs> something at it to bump it out? I wouldn't, just because we're over a road. You know? All right. Pika. I just back to get it out of the tree. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm sort of on the ground. I'm in the back of a truck right now. Um, the good fine folks at Pico have the tools to win these types of things, and guess what? Dave, who works for Pico and is a, a listener of the show, heard what we were doing, arrived on the scene with his cherry picker in his Pico truck, ascended, we went up about 30 or 40 feet, popped the balloons, grabbed the doll, and it's his, man. All right, well, Vatch Project 2013 has come to a close. It, it was sort of a success, sort of a failure. It didn't last that long. The tech behind it was phenomenal. She just didn't stay in the air for very long. And I think, here with Engineer John, uh, you know, if, uh, just to spot guess, I, I guess the only real problem is not quite enough helium in the balloons, right? Yeah, we, we didn't have a flow regulator on the uh, helium tank, so we didn't really know how much actually volumetrically was in the balloon, so that might have been an issue. We were basically doing it with a ruler. Thought she was gonna get up to 1,000 feet. Yeah. She made it to 50. You know, two, so that's two, two something. And sank. Right, and then yeah. came down. But listen, a, a winner, uh, a guy who's listening to the to the show, listening to the program, a guy named Dave, uh, he won. You know, and, and he he's the guy that deserved it. He had the key, you know the uh, the tools to get bad. He used his Pico truck, went up into the tree, and he got her, and he, he called in and had the phrase that wins. So uh, we got it to somebody who wanted it, and then the uh, the text winner as well. So in that respect, definitely success. Anything else to add? Uh, we didn't have to go to New Jersey and deal with jug handles, so it's Absolutely, a good day. yes. <laughs> in, that, in my book, that's winning. So uh, I guess we'll see you in 2014, yeah? yeah absolutely. All right. That's Vash Project 2013 for the Preston and Steve Show.